to Barefoot Soul Journey. You are here with Maria and today's three minute moment is about self-care. I know if you are a busy parent that life just sometimes feels like it's not going to stop. Now while I am personally at the luxury end of home education, I have one child these days that is being home educated. At one point I had five and so I understand the chaos of those days and how that feels and how hard it can be to structure in self-care. The first thing I would like to say about self-care is that you need to take some time to reflect on what it is that you really need. I think that it is really important to take some time to think about what self-care is and what self-care isn't. Also to think about how you can have self-care while having children and family around you all the time. There were some real key ways that I could do that and I have chosen things that are meaningful to me based on what I need so I have identified what I need and I have found a way to make that happen I like to have time reflecting I'm an introvert and I recharge through reflective me time sometimes that is as simple as putting on a pair of headphones uh, listening to an audiobook and kind of zoning out the rest of the world sometimes that's about doing a mindfulness uh, meditation. I like to use Sam Harris's uh, Calm app. I like to journal and I journal in three different ways. I keep a creative journal, which is like an art journal, an electronic journal, which is things that I want to reflectively make sense of. And I keep a mind dump written journal. I just mind dump and I just get whatever's going on in here, taking up space down on paper. As well as identifying things that you, might like it is also helpful to think about things you don't want to do so for me i have cut down on my social media usage i have deactivated my facebook account and i've logged out of instagram and yeah i found that that has been incredibly helpful to my mental health i was finding that they were masking something else which was a deep need for connection and so rather than doing them I've started scheduling in spending more time with people. They're just some examples of the type of self-care that I have identified are meaningful to me because they fulfill a need and create a space that I think is really important in my life. They may not be the right things for you, only you can work out what the right thing for you is. But a good place might be to start is the type of things that you think that self-care isn't and writing a not list <laughs> and out of that you may find that you start to work out slowly what it is that you really do need you are important your needs are important who you are as a person is important and you are going to do a much better job at being present and mindful with your family if you make time for you it is so important so I have been Maria, you have been awesome, and I'll catch you on the website. Bye!